Hello friends, myself is Paula Sunnal and this part of tutorial I will show you how to protect FTP user ID and password. Previous video of FTP I show you how to create, how to install FTP, how to configure FTP and how to uh, configure FTP with uh, host name. So in this part of FTP, I will show you how to use FTP with user ID and password. Because previously created FTP, I show you FTP opened with anonymous users. That means anyone can open FTP with without password. So in this part of this video, I show you how to protect FTP and uh, some users that are permis permitted for open FTP who mm, those uh, users are open FTP so let's see friends how to configure of this FTP with user ID and password so this is my Windows Server 2012 machines and I have a FTP server so I go to tools and internet information service previously we created previously we create FTP previously we configured FTP so let's see go to Windows 7 and if we go to command prompt and type FTP and and it type anonymous and type in enter password so see my user is login without password so I can see um, here is a one file that is setup.exe So now I configured it with uh, users. So go to uh, it is my FTP configured. It is IIS manager. It is a configured FTP. It is a options FTP authorization. So now click on this options FTP authorization rules. So double click on it. Here is a authorization rules mode allow users anonymous users so anyone can access FTP sites so I can double click it so here is a lot of option you can allow all users you can allow anonymous user or you can allow specified users or group I I have a I created a one user and or I use specified users so tools active directory user runs computer so now I am creating a user for FTP so users right click new user so username is test FTP user logon name click on next type password next and finish so this is my uh, users that user can use FTP that only user can use FTP so now I go to my IIS server manager service so I select specify user because I have a one user you can uh, configure this uh, group or specify user or you can access your all of users this is the comment 
so I have a one user so I uh, type here the specify user names my name is test FTP permissions read and write only users that can use this FTP sites so I click OK now click on my FTP sites name and click on restart so now I go to my FTP sites this is my client machine it's a Windows 7 so I connect FTP so type username pre uh, first I typed anonymous username see uh, the FTP is opened or not so type anonymous and password is blank so see there is a login failed so now type my username is FTP test test FTP enter password required so I type my password see my user is login and you can uh, do it in Internet Explorer So I, uh, I can can previously be video I show you uh, I will I was so you uh, I create a, a create FTP with name so I open FTP with name So now FTP open, but see setup.exe. Setup. Uh, you can uh, see the uh, FTP, but you can't download it. See, click on setup.exe. See, this is find username or password. So you can type your username, test FTP password is so login see my file is ready for downloads so that's it friends if you like my video go to your facebook accounts and you can like my facebook page it is www.facebook.com about my computers or you can subscribe me on my youtube channel so that's it friends thanks for watching